The U.S.-Israel relations are again facing tensions after U.S. Secretary of State Antony Blinken reversed a U.S. policy position on Israeli settlements. Let's take a closer look. In a surprise move, U.S. Secretary of State Antony Blinken stated yesterday that the Biden administration views Israeli settlements as inconsistent with international law, a stark contrast with the Trump administration, which implemented the Pompeo Doctrine, which deemed settlements not per se inconsistent with international law. Uh, it's been long-standing U.S. policy under Republican and Democratic administrations alike that new settlements are counterproductive to reaching an enduring peace. Uh, they're also inconsistent with international law. Uh, our administration maintains a firm opposition to settlement expansion. This news comes in the aftermath of Israel announcing the building of 3,000 new housing units in Judea and Samaria in response to a terror attack this week. The Pompeo Doctrine, implemented in 2019 under the Trump administration, had reversed a 1978 State Department position deeming the settlements illegal. The Biden administration's announcement comes as a big blow to the state of Israel as tensions continue to rise between the two allies over the Israel-Gaza war and settlement expansion. In response to the announcement, former Secretary Pompeo stated that Judea and Samaria are rightful parts of the Jewish homeland and Israelis have a right to live there.